Hey guys, I wanted to make another skincare review because I had more um, experience with philosophy and I just wanted to talk about the stuff that I bought recently and um, you know, let you know my opinion on them. Um, I really love the idea of these, these uh, philosophy products. But I, I'm going to say that this morning I washed my face and right after I washed it with this, which is the cleanser, toner, and makeup remover all in one, I felt um, like a tightness, which I wasn't sure I liked. And then I waited and I put on this serum and I also felt a kind of a tightness, you know, which I'm not used to feeling because usually I'm using another product line which which doesn't give me that at all, which I really, really like. Now, where is it? Oh, yeah, this. And then I used the cream for dry skin, and I felt like a stickiness that lasted for a few hours, and truthfully, I still feel it. This is um, Hope in a Jar for dry skin that has that nice smell that I was... Mmm, I love it. It's delicious, but... um. I don't like the way it sits on my skin. It doesn't absorb in. So that bothers me about this. So I have a feeling I'm not going to buy this again. Um, I'm not going to return it, probably, because I would have to go all the way to Portland. But um, the stuff I really like, I think, is Derm Exclusive. This stuff goes right in and just seems to help a lot. And um, this is the best serum so far. This is Derm Exclusive. I really, really like these guys. So, um, the other one I wanted to talk about was Aloe Vella, because this stuff, wrinkless cream. Ugh, see, what happens is, this is nice cream, and when you first get it, it, it smells good, and it feels good, and it gives you a nice feeling on your skin, but after a while, this camphor smell comes out, because it's got camphor in it. Ugh, I can't stand the way it smells, so I don't want to use it. But it's got this light, really nice texture. There's something so nice about the feeling of this product. I love it. Except the smell. You know, so if I'm going to go out dancing or go out or um, be close to someone, I don't want to smell like camphor. So I end up not using this. I used to use it before I went out because it gave a nice um, smoothness to my skin. Um, but now it just smells like camphor. So it's like... The longer it sits on the shelf, the more like camphor it smells. So that stuff is not my favorite anymore. The same company, Aloe Vella, also makes Luxoderm, which has that with that stuff that burns, that has those incredibly good ingredients. But um, I don't know. They, they give you a big thick jar with a little tiny bit of product. So I'm against that. So then I was at the um, I was at TJ's the other day, TJ Maxx. And, you know, they have that fabulous skincare aisle with all that stuff, and everything's really cheap. So I found this rosehip oil, which was, where's the price on this? $9.99. So it was $10. Australian certified organic cold-pressed pure natural rosehip oil. So I like the way it smells. Yeah, I can still smell it. Camper. Um, yeah, You know, it's a nice light smell. Oils are good. I really bought this because of, you for using Derma Wand with Derma Wand. Um, I thought it would help glide really easily. And um, I was, and it's always good to have oils. With, and oils are just plain good for you. If you use really good quality oils, you, your skin, your body, everything is going to be better. So, and oils absorb into the skin. Um, see, this this stuff, I put it on my neck. I, I feel the stickiness all over my body still hours later. And so I'm really, really not happy with philosophy, and it was not cheap. So the other thing I got was argon oil. Now, this stuff you see everywhere. It's kind of expensive. This was $12.99, but a whole lot cheaper than, you know, $68 for this little tiny thing. So it's pretty big. Hera is the name of this company. Um, I think I got the, this you put in your hair and on your skin. So you can use it all over your body for your hair, for shine and hydration. And um, also it says you can apply it to the skin for added softness and shine. So I think I bought this because I, hmm, I like the way it smells. Oh, I like this stuff. Oh, that's heaven. This is nice. Oh, this is going to be good. I was noticing my my arms, you know, and I've had pretty nice smooth skin on my forearms all this time. 
And um, I've just really mostly been worrying about my neck and, and my chest and my face. But my arms have been pretty nice. Well, now my arms are starting to go. <laughs> it's so fun to get old. Yay! <laughs> and then buy, spend a lot of money on a million products trying not to get old. Fighting nature. Um, oh, I love this. I'm going to give two thumbs up on this delicious stuff. This is nice. And I have a feeling it's going to... It's going to work well with Derma One, and it's going to be really nice to put everywhere. <laughs> so, um, I'm still going to probably use this this neck cream. The neck, you know, this is a hardcore area, hard to hard to fight the aging neck. So I'm going to report on this later. I just wanted to say something about philosophy because, you know, I mean, it's a great company. People love it. Um, it's just for me, it's sticky. I didn't like stickiness all day, so that bothers me. Derm exclusive, still my favorite. This stuff really absorbs in. It's expensive too, but um, I am a big fan of these guys. So that's my skincare review today. Um, this stuff is excellent. So far, these are my two favorite things. Argon oil, that's pretty cool. So I'm going to get all into argon oil. So thanks for watching, guys, um, and I'll talk with you later. I have some other really cool things to review that are totally different from skincare, but really work, so I'll talk about those later. So anyway, see you soon. Big kiss.